beers on the couch right now. Um, my beer is empty. <laughs> it's time for some more Wix beer, Morningstar beer from Wix Brewery in Riverside, California. Love this spot. So, um, do you guys have, have beers? Uh, no. If I had a glass, I'd offer you. Hey, Mr. Bartender Dale. Um, let's, uh, let's get a couple little cups in here. Oh, you know, he can't hear me, Bartender Dale. Yeah, the theater audience can't hear me tonight, so every time I talk to somebody, I'm like, why are they ignoring me? But can you, can you grab us, like, uh, two, you got a drink already? Three cups? Yeah, at the bar, thank you. I gotta share, Wix, you know, beer is for sharing. So, uh, especially this delicious beer that we get from Wix. So you guys look like, uh, you just played a very exhausting set, and you deserve a cold beer, absolutely. So where did you guys come from tonight? Thank you so much. Uh, Riverside. Yeah, I'm just gonna pour Riverside. it out. Riverside. It's safer to oh, generally say we're from here. Yeah, it's <laughs> Riverside. Riverside. Inland Empire. Flat complicated. The revolution. <laughs> Absolutely. We're from everywhere. A little yeah. bit of everything. Huh? We're men of the world. We're yeah. flat and we're tied. No. <laughs> Those are classy and dignified. <laughs> Where are you guys from? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, who are you? Classy and dignified in like a Las Vegas hotel. So, okay, so nobody can hear you guys when you talk oh. directly into oh, okay. the mic. There you go. Well, then I gotta lean forward then. No, no, we gotta. Jose and Ryan, you guys, you guys, you guys, you guys must share. Share your mic. Share your mic. Cheers, Cheers, yes, absolutely. Happy vibe with the fucking red hair. Woohoo! <laughs> totally, totally. So, thank you guys for coming out. Um, tell us, uh, the, the viewer who has never, you know, some people tuning in tonight haven't heard of Fox Red Hairs yet. What should they know about Fox and the red hair? Um, we're dark rock and roll, I guess. Nick Cave and the Bad Seeds, The Doors, Black Rebel Motorcycle Club. Kind of a uh, storytelling type of songs that we usually do. Uh, about Lots of murder. songs about murder. Lots of songs about murder. I just Lots love murder. that the first thing you listed was Nick Cave. Oh my <laughs> god. Like, I just got so yeah. happy inside right now. Yeah, no, actually, absolutely. We actually covered Nick Cave song called Love Letter. Yeah, we covered oh. Love Letter. Yeah. So. get in the way of stuff because some people like music that I don't love it that much, but I love you guys. Personally, I really, really do. I love you guys. Oh, so we're already the favorites then? Woo! You really are, yeah. Right. <laughs> but I don't get to vote in Battle of the Band, she so says that to every band. I don't say that to every band, I promise. Um, but, uh, so, do you guys have some uh, bands tuning in to watch you live right now? Um, hopefully. <laughs> by the comments on the Facebook page. Also, if you're in the studio audience tonight, I know they can't hear me, but somebody spread the word, uh, you wanna, and you want to vote, and you don't want to go on your phone or something and vote, you can vote with the bartender. Write it on a piece of paper, give it to the bartender, put it in his bucket, and I count those votes at the end, too. Can we, can we win more beer if we win? Right, what's the... What's the That's all we here? want. Um, we it's, it's a little prize package. That <laughs> Is there beer in it? <laughs> Um, I should put beer in it. Yeah, there probably will be because we have some beer stuff. Okay, that's the beer. correct answer. That's so, um, yeah, we're not really sure exactly what it's all going to consist of, but it's going to be a prize package, something that the whole band can use. We can all use for the beer. Whole band, so. True story. Um, yeah, we're going to have 12 bands total to battle the band. This was round three. So we've had, after Pop Heart performs, we'll, that'll have been six bands. So we're halfway through after tonight. Then six more bands are going to perform, three more episodes, you know. Yeah, uh, to each episode, and then we're gonna go into, and that'll be the end of March. So we'll go, or sorry, the end of beginning of April, we'll start the semifinals. Awesome. All right, that sounds So, um, you know, maybe you guys will be here for the semifinals. You guys will be back again. Hopefully, yeah. 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 Totally, totally. I'm pumped. I'm so excited you guys are here. So, tell us a little bit about what's the, is there a message behind the music? Um, not really. It's just uh, storytelling things. Um, because you're Justin's girlfriend, don't make him mad. <laughs> <laughs> Despite my songs about murder, okay? No. I'm not very proud of I'm beautiful. I'm not very great. Well, I'm going to tell whatever about uh, my flightless bird. Oh, uh, well, uh, yeah. yeah. Well, flightless bird is uh, uh, really, I, just, I wrote the song about um, a morphine addict in the 20s uh, going to a sanatorium, really. And it's just uh, him, his. Uh, point of view of just uh, talking about, you know, him in the sanatorium and him needing for morphine and things like that. And then I guess at the very end, it's kind of a retro.
contribution, or he yeah. just shakes himself to death. You know, one of the two. <laughs> wow, <laughs> some deep shit, right? Usually it's violent. <laughs> <laughs> I guess like, I guess, like every song is its own story. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's, a lot of songs are very storytelling. No, I love that. It's very like Nick Cave, you know, does that, and he tells like great stories. Yeah, that's what we try to do. I've been listening to Nick Cave since I was 14, and eventually I want to do a band like that, and I gather these wonderful musicians that I've known for years, and thank God they, uh, you know, deal with my annoyances. That's where beer comes in. I promise to be here. That's why we're so adamant about getting beer in our care package. Absolutely. No. The, uh, the other song we played was uh, We Get By, which is, I don't know, just kind of like a 90s alternative Jane's Addiction kind of sounding song, I guess, about a guy who just doesn't care if he screws his life up, but then he finds this uh, woman and he falls in love with her, and now that he's fallen for her, anything that he does wrong, he's like, I I gotta fix this, because now I'm not one person, I'm two people, you know, so. Wow. <laughs> no, I like this. No, I think there is a message behind the music. Each, so each song has its own little message there, its own thing. That's really cool. No, I love your sound, I love I love your content, I love what it's all about. So, and I love you guys are from Riverside, Revolution, totally, totally. Yeah, I came up with Revolution in the car today, and I, I'm, I'm not going to stop saying it. I'm going to say Revolution as many times as I possibly can. There we go, and we can see a little bit better now. Your camera's right there. There you go. The revolution will not be televised. But it is. Oh, all right. We really are having a revolution here in Riverside. Downtown Riverside is blowing up. All of Riverside is blowing up. Epic Vibes, finally, you know, Epic Vibes is here showcasing all of this awesomeness that happens in Riverside. Um, I don't know about you guys, but when I was in high school, I went to Arlington High School in Riverside, and um, I, people would like, oh, I can't wait to get out of Riverside as soon as I graduate. I'm going to move to L.A. because the scene here sucks, blah, blah, blah. And I go, hello. You're, if you think the scene here sucks, you're not. Like that. Yeah. <laughs> not building one. Yeah, yeah really. absolutely. Don't complain about a local scene not being to your liking and then not support that local scene. Yeah, if you are going to complain about the local scene and you don't go to local shows, get the hell out of here. You know what I mean? you got to support your local artists. you got to support your local yeah. shows. That's why we try to go to local shows and support everyone we yeah. with. You know, and that's why we around. never leave a gig until it's over. Yeah. Which guys got the right that idea? That is the worst bad form thing a band can do. Oh, we played our set. Bye, test. See ya. Bye. No, but they do it all the time. Yeah, that's why. Artists that's do it. Artists, you know, and, and hip hop artists do it. And no, all kinds of performers. Do that. They show up. They do their set. They do their thing. They're a rock star, you know, and then so then they bounce. And I'm like, yeah. how do you expect? Like, who's you're not gonna have a, you know audience if you keep doing that because yeah. you're the audience. Like, hey, 